Is liberty dying where you live? Escape to Keen at freekeen.com. Pulling me over like this. I'm a single guy in the car, driving under the speed limit, obeying the law, but I'm pulled over. <laughs> Silver Jeep pulled over right out in front of Campus Convenience and Andy's bikes. <laughs> What's up, guys? A second unit coming over here. What's going on, Kyle? Hey, it's going on, bud. The Keen police ID the man and go back to their car. I approach and he encourages me to film the stop. I offer to sit in the passenger side to better record the scene. Absolutely. So we got Rob from Keen and I'm here in the uh, in the cab now, so just make sure yeah. these police behave themselves. Stand by. Absolutely. He thinks he can just pull over anybody because, you know, for whatever reason. I'm a law abiding citizen that wanted to get gas tonight because I didn't want to get up at five o'clock to get gas in the morning before I work in Nashua. You think they're gonna <sighs> intimidate me. So are you born and raised here, Rob? Absolutely. I was actually born in the old Elliott Hospital at um, Keene State. Mm -hmm. Been here for <sighs> a long time. So these guys have just been picking on college students all night. I absolutely you can imagine. believe it. I, I watched some uh, cop. Cop's name is Matt Griffin. Oh yeah. That uh, was uh, giving a bunch of cops, uh, 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 kids a hard time because they weren't walking straight. So they were just automatically drunk. Wow. No reason yeah. at all. And this cop- He's just, one of the worst perpetrators. And this cop just pulled me over because he thought I was accelerating fast because he can see at 1.20 in the morning. Well, was I speeding? No, sir, you weren't. Well, then why are you pulling over? Because I accelerated to 20 a little bit faster than what I'm supposed to. You don't have to talk to them. You don't have to answer their questions. Okay. Just ask them if you're being detained and if you're free to go. That's what I'd recommend. Hey. Well, I am definitely the type of person to fight anything. So, well, not like literally fight, but you know what I mean. Sure, sure, yeah. I don't let any... Oh, uh, Kyle's over here. Push me over. I like the fact the other cop was like coming over and shining yeah. in his lights. Like that's supposed to be intimidating. Ooh, I might have something in my vehicle. Yeah, he thinks he's saving the world. Yeah. Pulling over me. Yeah. And they have so much more like... I was down at um, Cumberland Farms getting mm -hmm. gas, literally watching people walk out of the store with stuff and not paying. I felt bad for the old guy because his old security guy didn't, you know. There's so many kids in there. I was in right. there too for a you second. Know, it's like, what is he gonna do? You know, he can't really pick a fight. Then you could have all, all these, you know, kids against the guy. I would not even be open on a night like that, you know? Right. It's just too much <laughs> theft in one night. I, I, I got to be a lot of shrink, know? but maybe the, uh, you know, maybe it's the cost of doing business. Maybe they're lined up, people buying things. Yeah. So. This is the part where they want you to sweat it out. <laughs> I asked him exactly, what am I doing wrong? And he said, I was accelerating fast. like. Well, I wasn't going over 25 miles an hour, but I can, you know, whatever. I hate cops like that. Don't get me wrong. I think they have a job and they can do some good. They can. When it's, when it's appropriated. But like, yeah. you're pulling me over like this. I'm a single guy in the car, driving under the speed limit, obeying the law, but I'm pulled over. And obviously, by you talking to me, you obviously know, and you could smell that I haven't been drinking. Oh, have you been drinking, sir? No. Have you been drinking, sir? You just asked me that. Yeah, they like to uh, play games. I'm especially, I have a, especially pissed off because I'm a downtown merchant. I have oh, yeah? business downtown. And I hate the fact that they're giving the people a hard time over the parking shit. Like, why is it against the law to actually put a quarter in in front of somebody else? Well, that's the, that's the thing. It's not against the law. So they're You're suing us in civil court. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. So what What business downtown, Rob? I own uh, Rob Maggart's hair studio. And actually, oh, cool. I have a client that's a parking meter lady. And 
that and, right? And, yeah, and I actually asked her, and she was like, "Well, well, now we're getting a lawyer because we want them to pay for our lawyer's costs." And I just looked at her. I was like, "Why should they have to pay for your lawyer's costs? What have they done wrong?" Well, they're stopping from doing our job. I'm like, no, they're not. They're actually filming you. They're not like standing in your way and stopping you, right? No. Well, then how are they disturbing you? It's just, it's just a big plot to try to stop it. They don't like that they, that we've saved over 6,000 people from getting tickets. I mean, they don't like <laughs> the fact that they're actually being oh, putting on Here comes the one of them. Here they both come. Yeah. Remember, you don't have to answer their questions. Robert, I'm issuing you a summons to appear in the Keene District Court on For December what? 3rd at 8 o'clock in the morning, okay? Summons is for reckless operation. There was no reckless operation. Oh. Oh. Absolutely. There you go. Because you were totally out of line. How are you? So did you call her any uh, real bad guys tonight? Your time. I heard there was a fight or something. Depends on what you consider bad guys, I guess. Well, people fighting. That's, that's bad. Fighting's bad. You were wasting your time. If you don't appear, Robert, they're going to issue a warrant for your arrest. So I don't have to answer you. Third. Anything you have to say, goodbye. You can just take me down the street. Absolutely. I'd love to take you anywhere over these... Rob. Fucking peckerhead. <laughs> Sorry about that, but this was totally uncalled for. Reckless driving yeah. at 20 miles an hour? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> 20 miles an hour, and I'm reckless driving. I'm totally taking you so, to court, dude. So, how many times have they pulled you over in the past? Um, pulled me over not too long ago for not yielding. Now, this is a funny one. I couldn't see this little old lady because she was standing behind a car. But I got pulled over and got a ticket because of that, because mm -hmm. I didn't see them. Like, how am I supposed to see a four foot two lady behind a Dodge Ram truck? But because the cop was parked on the opposite side, he saw her, but I didn't, but it's totally right. my fault. And to make him happy, I'm gonna turn right back around. <laughs> <laughs> These guys are such jokers. <laughs> Come on, follow me! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> So where were you going before they pulled you over? I was actually going to go home because yeah. I did. I was going to get gas so I could get up, make my kids breakfast, not have to worry about getting gas. But because I pulled out of Cumberland Farms and took a left by um, that bar, uh, McHugh's. Yep. And he was pulling out of that street by that new um, Keen housing or whatever. Speaking of McHugh's, I'll be there on Sunday at 6 o'clock in the evening. There's a nice group of folks that meet. Talking about all kinds of fun stuff. All right, cool. And uh, you can drop me off wherever you darn well, please. All right. Actually, I want to stop right here so you can, because you know the cops are going to be bothered. I'll Rob, I appreciate it, man. Hey, thanks, thanks for the thank ride. Thank you very much. Drive safe out there. Absolutely. And uh, remember, don't consent to searches and don't talk to those cops. Absolutely not. See you later, dude. Thanks, buddy. Yep. <sighs> What's up, guys? Woo! What year is it? What year is it? 13? 13. Last time I checked. Yeah, guys. What's happening? 2013. Pumpkin Fest. How Fucking the fuck right. are you? Fucking right. Pumpkin Fest. Fuck good yeah. Time. Did Having you guys go a last day year? out here. No, we're, we're freshmen. First time Pumpkin yeah. Fest. Okay. All right. All right. My boys yeah. just go here. But it's pretty they play hockey. Hey, do you guys know your rights about the police? Do you? Yes. We'd like to invite you to visit freekeen.com. Freekeen.com features audio, video, and blogs chronicling the transition to a voluntary society. Freekeen.com also has comments and discussion forums so you can be heard. Freekeen.com. I should be in Keene, New Hampshire with the Free Staters.